his neck. You already know nigga Rex in effect. Keep a hot but don't make a mess. You already know police signing they checks. Young squeeze man told the Rex. You wanna see a face up in the press? Pussy pop. Squeeze game, you already know what's the vibes, man. It's your boy Sos. Happy Thanksgiving. This Thanksgiving, y'all. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Hope y'all enjoying eating good with the family. <clears throat> I'm on, we gonna be dropping videos all day. The gang finna pull up later. I'm cooking, so I'm in between cooking and doing reactions. I'm like, nigga, I'm gonna do some dolo. Then the gang gonna pull up later. We gonna knock, we gonna knock it down today. But Lil Bro sent me this last night. <clears throat> They was fighting this shit on Adam 22. I never reacted to no Adam. I fuck with Adam 22. I fuck with no jumper. I never reacted to none of that shit, though. So we gonna see what's up. I rock with them, though. I rock with them. And I, I watched the Kelpie. Fake ass little pimp. I watched his interview last time with Sharp. Sharp took him up. So, and Son was there, too. I don't know Son's name. But he was there. <laughs> he was there and um they was wild on Kelpie like they was exposing him like yo bro you ain't no fucking pimp gang <clears throat> so let's see what's going on this part 2 of the interview I guess he came back Adam brought him back now so Adam on the interview let me see what's the vibes I wanna hear I wanna see what led up to him getting beat up but I'll wait till we get to that let's get to it No Jumper Coast Podcast on World and today pretty excited cause we have somebody who's uh Making a big splash on the scene. Yes, sir. Kelby is a... See, this is how you know we from two totally different walks of life. Because I think they like California, West Coast side type shit. East Coast nigga. I, I doubt any nigga from New York ever heard of Kelby. If you from New York, squeeze gay, leave a comment if you heard of Kelby. Besides Adam doing an interview with him. Like music wise or his pimping or whatever the fuck he got going on. I never heard of him. Hello, Kelpie, uh, also known as Kelpie the P. As a matter of fact, you can call me whatever you want, just don't call me broke. So That's yeah, right. I'm out here today. And then co-hosting with me. Vic says, Gary, with this flurgery, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, almighty for the album, because the record too short, you dig what I'm saying? That was the real deal, you know what I'm saying? Hollyfield, you know what I'm saying? Not the impersonation. Damn, he just came with a whole little monologue like OJ the Juice. <laughs> that was fire. Um, okay, so I wanted to like... Hop in here yeah. and attempt to, you know, have a conversation that perhaps can build on some of the other conversations that have already happened. Yeah. So let's, let's lay this all out. So yeah. you yeah. had a very, very uh, viral appearance on Soft White Underbelly. Yeah. Tell me what happened. Like, what what was your life like in the lead up to that? Why did you decide to do that? Uh, in the lead up to that, I was uh, I was hustling. I don't want to say specifics, but I was doing a little a little shit in the streets, and then. Uh, I'm not gonna lie to you, uh, if Lil Kelpie was in my hood hustling, niggas is robbing Lil Kelpie. <laughs> For them grave niggas is taking Lil Kelpie. Everything Lil Kelpie got. Shoes and everything. Yeah, we from New York. It gritty. Niggas is taking Kelpie's shoes out here. He ain't hustling nowhere in, my, in New York, nigga. You crazy? Where he gonna hustle at? <laughs> Not in the hoods, at least. He probably hustled up in Scarsdale or something. I was like, you know I what? I thought you've already felt the sense about what you were doing. Yeah, I mean, well, well, Sharp made some accusations about what I was doing. I don't want to admit or uh, deny those, but okay. yeah, basically I was getting money and shit, and then that hustle came to an abrupt end when I got raided, so then I switched into another one because I seen some people that needed help, and you know, I just jumped into the game. Describe getting raided, though. Oh, uh, well, I was outside vaping and shit, and like, you know, still hustling, and the girls were inside, um, and basically... Just got a no-knock raid. They came in. They pulled me outside some undercovers, and they, like, drew their guns on me and shit like that, put me in the squad car. And then they all just were, like, inside my house and, like, yo, we got a warrant to search your person and your, your vehicle and, and your house. But they were suspicious of you probably. Yeah, they, they were trying to say in that I was, like, you know, drug dealing or, or something like that. Okay. But you don't have a cape? So what was the cause of them to come search your crib, though? You did it. You must have made a sale with somebody or something, and they must have told on your dumb ass. As a result of this? Uh, nah, I never heard back from him, honestly. Yeah. What? Bro, I watched that last interview, bro. That nigga said they took, like, some bands, like, 20, 40 bands, some shit like that. So the police raided your crib, got drugs, did all that, and you ain't catch a case? Pfft, I need to hustle where he at. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. 
And so then you decide, like, how did the software learnability opportunity even come about? Uh, well, I've been trying to do some, like, online stuff and just get that internet money and also promote uh, my girl's OnlyFans. Okay. Uh, so basically, check out Crystal Rose's on OnlyFans, by the way. She's going up. Uh, but no, basically, I was just trying to promote that stuff. So I went on Soft White, talking about my story. And then, yeah, it just kind of blew up from there. So what was the feedback like? Like, what would you describe as the most common comments that you saw in response to the software vulnerability thing that were really driving it being viral oh just a lot of hateful shit about the way i was dressed mostly people was like and also i feel like they took a lot of the shit i said out of context like when i said i was homeless that was because i just got evicted after the raid the apartments had like kicked us out with some section eight that i was staying with my family and the girls so they kicked us out of that and then a lot of people were like oh why is he dressed like a party city pimp fake pimp <laughs> and all that but you know it's all real you know the the outfit i feel like that's the most thing that people said was being disrespectful but i was just doing that to get attention but all my jewelry is legit and stuff so uh, and diamond tested, suspect you know. fill me in on that like is there is there something expected of you before you've earned the stripes to wear certain types of like pimp outfits nah it wasn't even that it was like we felt like that shit like the equivalent for to to, to get everybody to understand kind of like kind of like blackface mm. you know what i'm saying like that shit was kind of like like it's it like a costume you, you get what I'm saying? Right. It's like, he I came in here, he came in here wearing that shit like in his head like, oh, this is what pimps is supposed to look like. I got my little dollar sign chain, my yeah, little fur coat. Two of them. But do you, do you feel like, you know, you could... Kelby became, trying to become a pimp off the internet. That nigga looked at YouTube. He ain't no, no pimps. He just straight... Look, YouTube, how can I be a pimp? And went and did it. And went and tried to do it. And real pimps ain't jacking that, nigga. Real players ain't jacking that. Feel me? I know a few pimps, nigga. Them niggas always go to jail. You don't want to go to jail with that charge either. Yeah, because you always be a sex offender in New York State at least. Yeah, you got some pimping shit going on and you get locked up, nigga. You coming home, you registering. <laughs> Facts. Have Rock the same fit or something similar? But I mean... I'm true to this, so of course I could. But that's the so same thing. Up. Like I'm black, blackface. You get what I'm saying? Like okay. it's, it's like wear blackface. But so, so like, but aren't there I, white pimps there at these pimp conventions? Uh, white shit? folks, white of folks course. is a popping ass white pimp. And you didn't I even bet know you doing who he was no, no, no. until right now. But I, I know who he is. I know who we he is. We asked you that last interview. You had no clue. <laughs> you didn't ask me about no white pimps last time. The nigga sharp said, "You know who the fuck white folks is?" You was like, "No, I don't." You didn't know who the fuck that was. That was on Facetime before the interview. Exactly. You didn't know who the white folks was until we informed you. Until Shark informed me on Facetime before this interview. Until a pimp informed you. Yeah. Wife. Until a real one informed you. Photo sharp. I fuck with sharp. Sharp. I will lie. Sharp. Yo, listen. Leave a comment if y'all want no jumper reactions. No, I fuck with no jumper. I fuck with Sharp and I fuck with AD. But you yeah, know what I'm no saying? There's until, white pimps out there. Somebody informed so I don't get how it's, it's how it's blackface. That, you know that seems like you're bringing up racism where it doesn't need no, to be. No, 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 no. That was just a um. That was just an analogy to get everybody to understand. I'm not saying that you were doing. It's, it's you said I was doing blackface to get basically. everybody to understand. Yeah, because you 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 pulled up in a pimp costume. You were saying it was like blackface, but is, is it the fact that he's like, white in general, or is the fact that he's no, no, so no, no, new no. in the game? It's just he's. It's, it's just because he's not really doing that shit in his head. <laughs> he came. But I ain't like, really doing you know that what shit. I'm saying like he came. That. That's like, what's a good analogy? Well, I just gave one, like blackface. But let's do another one, like 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 a nigga who go to the gym with all this shit and he looking like he finna ball the fuck up. You feel me? And then when he get the ball, he can't do shit. But he came in his head like this. Is what ballers look like? I'm gonna get the headband, the socks, and all that shit. You get what I'm saying? Like uh, what, that's what, what I'm if he saying. starts learning how to play ball and then he starts balling harder than other motherfuckers? Right? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Because, yeah, bro, that was a bad fucking analogy to try to use. That was a bad one. Because you could get nice. <laughs> Facts. Is he still impersonating at that point? Everybody's a little kid trying yeah, to be like Michael Jordan at one point, right? right? And then right? Well, the next day, boom, yeah. you are Michael Jordan. You gotta crawl before you can walk, bro. Mm -hmm. So everybody starts somewhere. And I feel like y'all are hating on that because not even the... But I'm just saying, bro, like, I feel like you can't become a, like, a pimp shit. That shit is in you. You can't just, like decide today I want to be a pimp like you feel me that shit is in you that nigga watched YouTube to become a pimp you feel me I'm not dragging that shit like nigga that shit is in you you ain't no real player like 
I don't know. He might be a real player, though. Shit, little dude might be doing his thing. Who the fuck am I to say he not? You feel me? I just don't think he is. I think he is ass is cap. Thing, because I feel like we're all the same, no matter what color we are. But I feel like it's because of my age and because of how new I was to the game that y'all just attacked me for. That's it. nothing to do with that. I really? Like, I don't feel like you're That's new to shit. That's not what it seemed like. I feel like no, 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 no. I feel <laughs> like you're not new to shit. I just feel like you're an impersonator for your SoundCloud career. You're not new to shit, nigga. But bro, I don't even focus on music. You came up in here. I focus on the streets. I focus on the streets. much you profess. Let's see. Look at him. He's this little dude. This nigga said, "I ain't focused on music. I'm focused on the streets and getting money." This little dude wanna go to jail and you're gonna get locked up and tell him somebody, bro. It's just the shit that's just why the game's so fucked up, bro. This nigga told me I ain't worried about you should be worried about music. This shit should be all capped so you can fucking boost your music career, cause we know you ain't like that. Come on, man. I'm sorry I gotta keep lighting this fucking blunt, this big ass blunt. Old school, and then you was like, we, "Yeah, we actually where you like this shit from?" And then you said, "Yeah, I watched you. I watched Shark on YouTube. Like, yeah, get the fuck out of here, nigga. Well, I, have no, not some, I didn't have no mentors in real life. You could watch on 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 YouTube and in person and, and start nigga, getting money from get it? in the fucking streets, nigga, and get some real experience. For yeah. more money, but the, look, I, nigga said he never ran a track. If y'all don't know what that is, y'all better figure it out. <laughs> but he never ran a track, bro. This, I mean, yo, Pimpin is like, I don't want to say it's dead, but it's. Damn near dead, bro. Pimping is damn near dead, bro. It ain't the same as it used to be. And I know that. And I've never been a pimp. But I know it's dead because there's so much ways bitches can do it they self. Like, bitch can sell pussy from her crib now. Like, they don't need to be outside. They don't need no nigga protecting them. Well, they still might need a nigga to protect them. So, yeah, it probably it ain't dead. You know, niggas got all the back pages and shit like that. So, the pimps probably be running that shit. That shit is like... Everything is motherfucking... Through the phone now, nigga. They can spin it through the phone now, nigga. With the internet. <laughs> All these drill kids are looking at day. older drill rappers Experience. and fucking getting but they really outside right? drilling though. But but he's really outside, outside drilling. Really outside drilling. Nah, really it's not. Really, I brought two bitches it's with me. Not. I haven't seen none of your bitches. That don't mean shit. Because I'm working on the couch. None of your bitches. Right. None of your bitches. Because I'm really doing it. Oh nah, this nigga got bitches with him too. Real shit though, that's real. You gonna go to jail for playing around, bro? They're fucking goofy, bro. You order, you order interview. Talk about I've been in the streets, bro. Come on, my nigga. You fucking goofy. Bring some fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. Oh, nah. Help you try to turn up. Niggas, you being a play hater. You being a play hater. That's what I'm violating them bitches. They on the couch. Them bitches dusty as fuck, cuz. <laughs> nah, I'm fucking with son. That's cool. I, I'll say that. That's cool. You ain't got no bitches. When the police watching, I don't have no bitches. I'm a podcaster. Let me just interrupt real quick. I'm an OnlyFans manager when the police let me, ride. Let me just interrupt real quick. This nigga said, I'm an OnlyFans manager when the police is watching. Bro, shut the fuck up. The police always watching, nigga. You sound goofy. I ain't gonna lie. Yo, suspect. Interview done. Interview with suspect. I ain't gonna lie, suspect. You should have been smacked this nigga up in his fucking mouth. You did it though, so I can't even talk shit. Cause you did it. We about to see it in a few minutes. Hey, you, bro. All right, hold on. <laughs> People try to pull that, ball. pull that out on Sharp and stuff too. Yeah. Like, where's your bitch? I'm gonna be real. Like, me and Sharp have been in the same group chat for like a couple years at this yeah. point. So I've seen some of the girls they spends time with. He definitely has some attractive women in his life. I have no idea what their relationship is, but. Also, you know, you gotta respect it. Like, fucking, if I had, like, all kinds of girls, I would probably try to keep some kind of distance between my professional life and bringing chicks around all Thank my you. employees and stuff. I mean, I am somebody who lives my whole fucking life on the internet, so it might be kind of different for me. But, yeah. I mean, just because he don't necessarily... I, this guy's seen him. I've seen some women trailing him before. <laughs> niggas better... Niggas I ain't really seen know. It. Nigga, I'm I on tracks, boy. 
Fuck out of here. I ain't never seen no bitch whore. See, look, my son says, but you let this nigga trick you, though. You let this nigga trick you, bro, into talking like that. You shouldn't be saying that shit, man. Fuck this nigga. I'm no oh, Kelpie. Right, Kelpie the fuck? Kelpie the motherfucker. Kelpie the clown. Fuck out of here. 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 Fuck out of Adam pussy, Adam get him out of there. <laughs> little ass boy, fucking stupid. Is you fucking stupid, little ass boy? I ain't gonna lie though, my sub was all timing, but he definitely threw the muffins at him. Y'all gotta go see the video. I'm mad that they like blocked that shit off. My son hit him with 30 muffins though. He was fucking Kelpie up on that couch for the grave. That nigga hit him with 30 muffins. Them shit look like they were soft as hell though. Kelpie ain't got a scratch on his face. Tell me no, bitch. You crazy. You crazy. I was in here chilling. Call me no, bitch. What's wrong with you, nigga? What's wrong with you, bro? Oh, that shit leaking? Hold on, I gotta find out. Watch it. Hold on, Little ass boy. Don't ask me to do all that, Slim. Nigga, come here, bitch. You is a bitch. Oh, look, he's still talking shit. You is a bitch. That nigga face bloody. Oh, nah, my son beat the brakes off him right quick. The fuck is you talking about, Goofy? I don't like the way the headphones sound. I'm going to take these shit out. Yo, like, comment, subscribe. Y'all already know the vibes. I'm out of here. Keep a hot but don't make a mess You ain't no pulley signing they checks Young squeeze man toe in the wreck You wanna see a face up in the press?